man. You know those people that uh, did you wrong? Did you dirty? You know those people? They're not ready to hear about it. They are not ready to hear about it. They are not ready to take accountability for the things that they've done, the things that they said. They just simply cannot take it back. And they refuse to take accountability, to apologize with sincerity from what happened and from what they've done to you. And like I said, they just refuse to apologize. They refuse to be real. They just want you to kind of, you know, forget what happened. And uh, excuse me in this video, I, I have my hat a little bit low because I want to kind of, you know, protect the light in the background that is in my eyes. Because I've got a bit of a headache, but here I am doing this video because I still feel sharp, but I don't want to really look at the light. It is what it is. So, that's why I have my hat down so low. It's not about how I look. It's about the message. And this is what I look like, so. There you go. I just don't really want to look into the light. But anyways. Um... <clears throat> it's just ridiculous, man. The, the entitlement that these people have. They're not ready to hear about what you're going to tell them about what they've done to you. They're just not ready to hear it. They don't want to hear it. They want to look past it. They want to look past it. They think you should just forgive them for the things they've done. And you know damn well that is a terrible idea. You know. I don't know what it is about people nowadays, man. I would not do... There's so many things that people do on a regular basis that I just wouldn't do. Like, I don't get people. I don't get why so many people do the things they do. So, so many people do things that make other people feel bad. Just little uncalled for things, too. Some things aren't even that big, but still... I don't do little uncalled things that, like, things that are uncalled for. I don't do those little things to make people bad, to, to, to make people feel bad. I just don't do them. The most that I do is expose these people on this channel. That's the worst you're ever going to see me doing. And I, I don't think it's bad at all because I'm protecting my mates. I'm protecting the people that are chosen to choose to watch this channel. Because I believe there's a lot of chosen ones that's on this channel. I believe there's a lot of woke people on this channel. And like, like I said, I just do not understand how so many people have the audacity to do the things that they do and to say the things that they say without any repercussion. Like I, I avoid making people feel bad when it's all said and done in real life. I'm just saying how things really are on this channel, 24-7, and it is what it is. I don't even target people in general for a majority of the time. But if somebody really does something, then you know what? I might expose you, and I'm not even going to say your name either. So really, I don't expose anybody. It's just like specific things that people do, it will get exposed. And like I said, like... The things that some people do, it's just ignorance. It's just... The things that they say, man, like, I would not do that. Do you know what I mean? Just the little uncalled for things that some people do on a daily basis or some things that people might say that rubs you the wrong way or it's just flat out ignorant. It's just not good. I don't do those things because I don't want to make people feel bad because I know what it feels like to feel bad. I don't want to make people feel bad. That's not what I want to do. 
Why would you want to do that? You must be a miserable... I don't know what. You must be flat out miserable with your own existence. And that's sad. You can't make yourself happy. You're too weak. Too spineless. Too cowardly because you, you, you can't even make yourself happy. You can't even take care of yourself. You're in a piss poor mood all the time and you're pissing everybody else off. Because that's what these people like to do. Some people are so low and down on themselves and they're bringing everybody else down with them. Because they can't stay happy. They cannot concentrate. They're not focused. They're not determined. And they like to say just uncalled for things out of nowhere. Their attitude might not be too, too bad at one point and then all of a sudden, boom! It's like they just say something or do something that is just like you felt it. Like, wow, you actually just said that or you actually just did that. You know what I mean? It, it, it's, it's situations like these. And it's also situations in the past like, you know, a lot of unnecessary, uncalled for things that people do. Immature shit uncalled for things that leaves you emotionally stunted and I'm not even gonna say traumatized but it's like it emotionally it does something to you to the point where you do not feel good you feel that darkness from what they did you feel it and there's not much you can do about it you're gonna feel it and you're gonna to have to get over it one way or the one way or another, and it is what it is. There's messed up people in this world. What can I say? They exist. They're out there, and it just makes no sense to me how people can be like that. How how can you not get yourself? How can you not get any steam going in your life whatsoever? You don't gotta be the next. Whoever that's rich, you know, you don't gotta be the next anybody. But to be that, to be that way, it's just you are at the absolute pits of hell. To be that way, you are not even close to average. You're not even average. You're you're below average. You're way below average. You are a scum of the earth. Get your head out of your ass and start being more respectful. What are you even doing? It makes no sense as to why you're saying the things you're saying. And this is a message to those people. It just makes no sense why you have to be like that. It makes no sense. You expose yourself. You expose your own weakness. Is what you do. And there's nothing anybody can do. For you. It's not going to be enough. And it's these types of people that really get under my skin. And it's these types of people, whenever I get serious, now they want to act all nice because they know a real dog's in the house. They know a real one is here. And they know they can't treat a real one like that. They, 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 cannot, they can bark a little bit, but you know what? When you haul back, they act real nice then. Like a little scared bitch dog is what they are. They can bark, bark, bark whenever you, you know what, you know what, it, you know what it's like whenever you show a dog, hey, I'm the alpha, I'm the alpha, you stay, and you listen, you know what the dog gets like, you know what the dog gets like, they shut up pretty quick, and they obey the master. And these people are the same way, I'm telling you, man, I see it firsthand. I've been in many of these situations where a particular, a particular person wants to make me feel bad. A particular person wants to say something to just rub me the wrong way or to startle me or, or to do something. And the moment I get serious, the moment I get serious is the moment they get real damn nice real quick. Because they know damn well what would happen. They can feel my energy. They know my energy overrides them. 
They know I override them in every way, shape, and form, and there's nothing they can do. The only thing they can do to save them damn selves is to shut their big fat mouths. It's what they do. And I guarantee you, even on YouTube, the people that comment unnecessary things sometimes, they would not say any of the things they say on YouTube to my face. I guarantee you they would not. And if they did, they'd change their attitude pretty quick whenever I responded to what they said in person. I guarantee it. And this is just how it is. There's pathetic people in this world for a reason. I mean, <laughs> they have to exist. If there wasn't those people, you know what? Those people just make us look ten times better, to be honest. They do nothing but ex expose themselves and their own weaknesses and their own flaws and their own insecurities and their own everything. It's what they do. They can't be real. They can't be a real one. They can't speak out like a real one. They can't do real shit. And they ain't about shit. And they get no results. And they're mad. And they're crying. In their mother's basement, eating those poor Cheetos. Like I mentioned in damn near every video lately. Those poor Cheetos. We gotta get our Cheetos back. It's what we gotta do. We gotta save the Cheetos. Because these people are the definition of pathetic. And there's even, you know what? <clears throat> you start doing better than certain people around you, man. People's gonna start to switch up on you. Even people that was treating you pretty good for a, for a while, you know? And then you really start to get these results. You start to get results that they're not getting. You start to level up above them. And they start to treat you bad too. It's like, what the hell? Like, people are just pathetic. Why do you have to be this way? It never, it, it, it will never make sense to me. I just, I can't relate. I cannot relate how somebody could be that way. Because it just exposes them. It's all it does. They don't understand. They think they're being this or that. You're being a complete tool. And you're looking like a complete doofus is what you it's what you look like. You are not nothing. Spineless is what you are. To act like that, to behave in a manner like that. Coward is what it really is. So But anyways, enough of that. And I just want to end the video about by saying one more time that the people that did do you wrong, they, they, they really don't want to take accountability. They really don't. Even these smart little remarks that people have to say, they don't want to take accountability. They think it's alright to do the things they do. They think it's alright. The people that really struck a nerve in you, the people that really did you wrong, they think it's all right that they never take accountability and never apologize and they think they still have access to your life. They still think you should take them back after years. Why? What in the hell did you do to deserve to come back into my life? Oh, you let time pass? You want to say things are better now? You want to use more words? More manipulation? Don't tell me you love me. Do not tell me you love me. You gotta show me. And that is it. Do not trust words. Trust actions. And everybody that you gotta deal with in a daily basis. And that's it. On to the next video. I'll be back.